Good day everyone. Again, this is Ernesto E. Felicin, TLE6 teacher of San Juan Elementary School, San Juan City, Metro Manila. Our subject for today is Technology and Livelihood Education, TLE6, and we are still on Industrial Arts. This is our second lesson, Conducts Simple Survey Using Technology and Other Data Gathering Methods. Conduct simple survey using technology. Another data gathering method. Our most essential learning competencies. 1.1 Conduct simple survey using technology and other data gathering method. To determine. 1.1.1 Market trends on products made of bamboo, wood, and metal. 1.1.2 Customers' Preference of Products 1.1.3 Types slash Sources of Innovative Finishing Materials, Accessories, and Designs 1.1.4 Processes in Enhancing slash Decorating Finished Products Our Code TLE6IA0B3 we will study how to conduct simple survey using technology and other data gathering method. Specifically, this module will help you do Objective 1. Discuss the market trends on products made of bamboo, wood, and metal. Objective 2. Identify the customer's preference of products. Objective 3. Identify the types slash sources of innovative finishing materials, accessories, and design. Objective 4. Apply the processes in enhancing slash decorating finished product. Market trends on products made of bamboo, wood, and metal. Philippine products are in demand not only within the local market but also in the international market. Locally manufactured products intended for the global market have unique designs and high quality craftsmanship that demand higher value and earn profits for the entrepreneurs. Customers' Preference of Products Products are in the form of home furnishings, tabletops, jewelry, decorative accessories, home accents, kitchen and garden decors. To have marketable and saleable products, artisans slash artists and manufacturers must know their consumers and their preferences in terms of color, style, size, and quantity. It is also helpful to know their interests and needs. Craft artisans and entrepreneurs must adopt new marketing strategies to reach their consumers. They must be creative and adopt new design trends for their products to be competitive in the market. Specific selling strategies include focusing on customer service such as Offering free delivery Repair and retouch services Special promotions it is important first to make a study of the business and the industry. The SWOT analysis may be considered when thinking of a business. S strength, W weaknesses, O opportunities, T threats. Types slash sources of innovative finishing materials, accessories, and designs. You must also know the types or sources of innovative finishing materials, accessories, and designs that you can apply to your products. These materials are used to beautify, decorate, and improve the quality of finished products. One finishing materials that are used to smoothen the products before decorating. Examples, varnish, shellac, lacquer, etc. Varnish is very durable because it contains a higher ratio of solids. Spar varnish is perfect for outdoor projects and for raw wood used for exterior doors and trim on rustic homes. In addition to protecting the wood, 
It also provides natural ultraviolet light protection. Spar varnish is often used on items that will be near or on the water, like a wood boat, decks, beach chairs, etc. Apply using a natural bristle brush. Shellac, fine furniture items can be greatly enhanced with shellac. Apply it with a natural bristle brush or with a cotton rag. Lacquer it provides the extremely intense gloss finish often used on ultra-modern furnishings. It is applied via a sprayer, because it is thinner than other finishes. You will need a high volume, low pressure, HVLP, sprayer and a well-ventilated and spacious workplace to apply it. Two colored paper twines and ribbon cloth are used in decorating and wrapping products. Three beads and charms are small accessories of different colors used to make products attractive. Four abaca and cinnamon fibers are paper-thin locally made materials used for wrapping or packaging purposes. Processes in enhancing slash decorating finished products. These were the processes that were discussed on the previous topics which includes the following. Wood turning. Hand carving. Pyrography. Flocking. Inlaying. Gilding. Staining. Painting. Other methods. A. Engraving. B. Etching. C. Texturing or embossing. D. Metal enhancing media. Though it is said that Filipinos are best known for their creative minds and hands, new trends in the market, and emerging strategies and techniques must be explored to allow local products to compete in the global market. We should remember. Enhancing bamboo, wood, and metal products into becoming unique and attractive is another job that you can do especially if these products are to be marketed to become an alternative source of income. Conducting a simple survey is important to determine the market trends, customers' preference of products and types of innovative finishing materials, accessories, and designs. Disclaimer this presentation was made for educational purposes only. No copyright infringement intended. Text, images, and clips, all rights credited to the owner. Thank you everyone, and God bless us all.